Next, we have Bring Back My Bars for January only. So the month of January, you can stock up on your favorite scents that came back. We voted on the best of the best, and these are what returned. Um, if you absolutely love this scent, again, I highly suggest Scentsy Club because you could save. And you get perks and rewards, and it's wonderful. So we have 25 cents here to sniff test. Super excited about these because there's a lot of good ones on this one. Um, so here we go. I'm just going to grab randomly here and let's go with Crumb Top. Classic fragrance. So let's put it back. Okay. The perfect blend of oats, butter, and brown sugar to top your favorite dessert. Yeah, you smell the butter. It's butter, brown sugar, something baking. It's wonderful. It's pretty yummy. I smell a little bit of cinnamon. There's gotta be some spices on there. But yeah, butter, brown sugar. It's pretty good. It's a cozy good. I like it. I like it. I would grab a couple bars, but I'm not sure if it's club worthy. Okay, next. go back and forth on the senses so my sinuses don't blend with all the the fragrances the similar fragrances melon apple melon and apple granita crisp apple and sweet melon surge with sparkling citrus yeah you smell the citrus sparkling citrus. It's like a, um, a tangy tart citrus. A little bit of melon. Doesn't scream apple. A little apple, mostly citrus. It's good. It's a good, I think, fruity blend mix. I'm not too crazy over it, to be honest, um, but it's a good fruity blend, okay? <laughs> uh, let's see, what do we got here? Perk me up, we have a coffee scent. Simply the most perfect cup of coffee you'll ever experience, a strong brew of Guatemalan coffee beans and just a touch of hazelnut smells like a coffee shop. It truly does. Like, I think I have coffee tree. That's okay. But this one screams coffee, screams coffee shop. It's good. Now, those of you that know me, I love coffee. And I think I would put this in my um, club to have it here and there or hmm, maybe just grab a few bars so you have it here and there I don't know I can't decide on that one yet <laughs> okay uh, fried ice cream fried ice cream vanilla with nutty touch along with cinnamon and caramel Smell the vanilla and cinnamon. It kind of, yeah, cinnamon, vanilla. Do you remember that bar? Kind of reminds me of that. Yeah. Cinnamon and vanilla. It's a sweet bakery scent. But yeah, it reminds me of cinnamon, vanilla. It's a warm bakery scent. Um, I don't know if I would grab this. I love cinnamon, vanilla, but I have it. It's good. It is good. Okay. Let's see here. What is this one? Coconut palm. Come on. 
computer's thinking. A blend of tropical coconut and musky patchouli with subtle green notes. It, to me, it just screams coconut. If you are a coconut fan, you will like coconut palm. I kind of smell green, yeah, on the bottom. Like a coconut, I almost want to say with a touch of rainforest, tropical rainforest. Very coconut on the top. I don't really smell patchouli though, I'll be honest with that. I like coconut, but I don't know if I love that. Okay, let's do peppermint rush. Now we currently have a perfect peppermint. Peppermint Rush got voted back. Peppermint, sweet vanilla, and a cord of fresh fallen snow. Whew. Yeah, that is like pure peppermint. Mm. It smells good. It doesn't scream vanilla to me. Fallen snow might, yeah, give it that little more zest for peppermint. Ooh, that is good. I like peppermint. That is good. All right, ooh, let's do, so this one, this is a funny story here. Pima cotton. This is like one of the scents that was available when I joined, Pima cotton. A light, clean blend of lilies, Freesia and Jasmine. Very clean and it has the powdery clean to it. And a little floral. Uh, to me, it doesn't scream floral. More like soap. It smells like soap. Yeah, very soapy on the bottom. If you like clothesline, windowsill breeze, I think you're gonna like Pima Cotton. It's okay, it's okay. Um, I don't care for the powdery scent to some clean scent, so. Mm. Okay. Let's do Sticky Cinnamon Bun. Cinnamon and sweet icing with warm, nutty nuisance. <laughs> now this one I like. I think I like this better than, hmm, what did I have? Fried ice cream. Definitely better than fried ice cream, I think. Crumb top is just totally, crumb top is more warm with the butter at bakery. Sticky cinnamon bun has more of the spices. Cinnamon, scream cinnamon right now. And sweetness. This one's good. I like this one. And I liked it when it was available. Like close to when I first joined. Yeah, it smells good. It smells good. Sticky cinnamon and crumb top would be a great mix. Okay. Let's do this one. I'm not crazy over this one. Autumn maple, oh sorry, autumn blaze maple. A bountiful harvest of crisp as apples and earthy pumpkins with golden maple syrup, warm cinnamon, and a rhythm of smoldering oak. Now, if you know me, I'm not crazy over maple scents. I'm not, I do like how this does scream autumn. It really does. If the maple was out of it, I would truly love this and this would go on my club. Um, yeah, it has, I think it's the oak, the cinnamon, and then the blend of apples and pumpkin. Oh, it's amazing, but that's, oh, the maple. The maple's gotta go, I'm sorry. <laughs> but it is a great, great autumn scent. Okay. I feel like there's a lot of bakery scents. Cranberry muffin. Bursting with bright cranberries, envelope and a buttery brown sugar batter with nuisance of walnuts and toffee. I 
some of the buttery brown sugar. It's, no, I don't like it. I smell cranberry, it doesn't scream cranberry. Definitely more buttery brown sugar. I don't really smell, maybe a little toffee. No walnuts. I don't care for it. I don't care for it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> so when you're smelling a lot of scents and you feel like you're getting overwhelmed, rumor has it that you smell coffee beans. No, that's not true because that's um, messing with your senses. Smell the inside of your arm. kind of resets everything. Okay, let's do this one. Flirtatious. Right now, this is one of my top sellers. I'm already selling a lot of flirtatious. Fruity and vibrant. A combination of green apple, grapefruit, and white amber. I've always... I, I've smelled this before because it's come back a few times. But this is like a little Carly scent. <laughs> mm. It's a sweet little girl scent. I think it screams more white amber than in grapefruit. Grapefruit. I smell grapefruit. But it's a good f fruity blend with amber. It's light. It's fresh. It's definitely a little feminine. It's good. It is good. All right, let's do this one. This one I feel like is controversial here. Coconut pumpkin pie. Fall's most delectable dessert enjoys an Exotic touch, pumpkin puree, grated nutmeg, maple sugar, hint of coconut shavings. It's a good fall scent. It's a good fall bakery scent. I don't, I just, yeah, I wouldn't want it in my house all the time. No, oh, I'm, I'm not crazy over it. I think it's the maple. Maple throws me off. But it's a good bakery fall scent. So if you like those, I think you'll like coconut pumpkin pie because that is definitely a popular one. All right, quiver. Quiver is back. There's a lot of talk about quiver and this is another top seller out of this collection as of now. Quiver, quiver. And this scent vanilla flower, warm sandalwood and sultry night blooming tur tuberose and a seductive scent meant to cause a shiver of delight. Like I said, this is a top seller. I'm not crazy over it. Sandalwood. I think the tuberose is very strong. Yeah, very sandalwood, tuberose. Kind of woody. It doesn't scream vanilla mm -mm. or floral to me. I, I'm not just not crazy over it, but it's it's a top seller for me so far. Okay, let's do rum raisin cookie. Freshly baked cookie dough, spiced with rum raisin and clove, will transport you to the corner bakery. I'm gonna be honest, this one's not bad. It isn't. It, the clove and the cinnamon, I love in it. You can smell the rum on the bottom for sure. Very strong, yeah, with the rum and the cloves. It's a bakery for sure. Bakery scent for sure. It is good. It is good. I just don't think it's club worthy good. All right, 
let's switch gears here. What do we have? Let's do woodland suede. This is a popular scent with the guys for sure. I've already sold a couple of these. Retreat to twan to a twan. Can't say it. Tranquil. Wooden Wonderland with red oak, smoky cedar, suede musk, and bright winter lemon. I mean, I think Woodland Suede definitely describes this bar. It's woodsy, it's masculine, it's suede. You could smell suede. It's good. I, I like it for masculine scent. It is good. Okay. Got a few more left here. Let's see. Do flower shop. This one is a popular scent and a top seller for me right now. Just like walking into a flower shop. That is the description and I will agree 100% to this. It's fresh. It is floral, but it's not perfume floral if you know what I'm talking about. It's very fresh. Kind of like a so fresh like a rainforest fresh. I am grabbing myself some of these. Mm, great spring scent. Yeah, it's amazing. I don't know if I would want it in my club because I'm not crazy over floral. Every once in a while I like it. This is a good one. All right, let's do Autumn Stroll. Classic. This is truly an autumn must have, okay? A, a harvest moon, leaves crunching underfoot, peppery cinnamon mingles with a dusky plum and warm wood. Incense to create a spicy and comforting fragrance. It's, it is spicy, very strong on the spices. Um, another top seller for me so far, this is going in my club because fall lovers, you want this. Trust me, you want this. It is strong with the spices. It screams fall and outdoors. It's a wonderful. Oh yeah. This, this is going in my club because this one's not in my club. Over there. Okay. Okay, we have a hazelnut latte. Hazelnut latte. I am not crazy over hazelnut. Um, however, this one's pretty good. Fravesti milk, toasted hazelnuts, espresso, and vanilla with a dusting of cinnamon. Yeah, I like this one. I, I mean, it's... So it's definitely got the warmness to the coffee, okay? Warmness. It, it, I smell hazelnut, but it doesn't scream hazelnut. It's a warm, a warm, cozy drink. I smell the vanilla for sure. And it doesn't scream coffee. There's a hint of coffee, hint of vanilla. It's just... It's a warm, beautiful scent. So I have two clubs. And I think I'm gonna put hazelnut latte and perk me up in my th every third month. I like them, but not all the time kind of like them. They would make a great blend too. Okay, moving on. Spiced berries. This one's already in my club because it's wonderful. And I'm so happy I have it in my club. Frankincense and myrrh. Really? Berries to create timeless? I would never guess that. It's a, it's not smoky like fragrance and myrrh. It's a great fall and even Christmas scent, winter scent. 
I love the berries. It's like a berry cider. Mm, so good. This is a top seller. Um, yeah. I think I said, I mentioned, Arn I think I mentioned Autumn Stroll. Autumn Stroll Spice Berries is another top seller for me right now in this collection. Okay, Apple Press. This one I remember when I first joined. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. It's a good apple. Chris Fall Days, Crunchy Apples, Juicy Pears, Hint of the Last Full Roses of the Summer. Oh yeah, it's a cozy apple. It is amazing, cozy home apple. It's juicy, it's fruity. Yeah, it's a it's a good fall scent. It doesn't have the outdoor or spices, but it's a great fruity fall scent. Fresh and clean. I, I'm gonna think about it, but I may put this in my club because it's a good apple. I like this better than Johnny Appleseed. Yeah, oh, I think I will. Yeah, I think that's a clubber. I think that's a clubber. Okay. Let's do this one. Vanilla cream. Vanilla cream. French vanilla with a touch of coconut milk. I think that's why I like it. I do like this one. I think the coconut milk gives it a good twist. It's a nice, calming, cozy scent, like for a bedroom. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's club worthy. I grab a couple bars, but yeah, it's good. It's light, it's cozy. Yeah, it's good. All right, what do we have? Well, let's do this one. I'm not, I don't know about this one. Mediterranean Spa. This has come back a couple times. Relax with the smooth, fresh, breezy scent. That's it. I smell, I get what they're saying, I smell that fresh air, but there's something soapy and perfumey about this I just don't care for. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just too, too soapy, too perfumey. Um, I wish that part was toned down a bit. Okay. I'm saving three, I have three left. Pear, blossom, and cucumber. It's the blooming beauty of spring. Delicate pear blossom, rain kiss, jasmine, honeydew, and Meyer lemon, smoothed by a splash of cucumber water. Yes. Very fresh, a great spring scent. It's cool, it's clean, it's light, I like it. I don't know. That's a questionable club, but I'll probably definitely grab some bars. Okay, and then we have green tea smoothie. I've been curious about this one and what it smells like. Pear blossom and cucumber was a top seller. Energizing green tea and fresh ginger with peach, nectarine, and cranberry. It's very light. Yeah, I, I'm not crazy over it. I think the nectarine's throwing me off with this one. It, it, it mostly smells like peach and nectarine. I don't really smell green tea and I love green tea. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. It would be a good spring scent, but I'm not crazy over it. This one, hands down. Everyone needs this one, in my opinion. Cucumber lime. This is um, a top seller right now, too. Cucumber lime. Cool, refreshing blend of mellow cucumber and tangy lime. It's like 
fresh, cool spring summer scent. It's tranquil, very tranquil. You smell the cucumber. It's a sweet cucumber and lime. It's not a very tart lime. It's a soothing lime and cucumber. I love it. Mm. So those are all 25 bars. Now, again, these are available for the month of January only. $6 a bar. You can do the three pack or six pack. That's your best bang for your buck. Um, six pack is $30. It's like buying five. You get the six free or put them in your club. You save on club. And what else? What else? Um, I'm not making samples of these. I will on request. So if there is a scent that you are curious to smell, let me know and I'll be happy to send you a sample. Thank you. Thank you for watching.